From the Royal Farms Arena in Baltimore, Maryland, the Destiny Championship Alliance welcomes you to the first co-branded mega event of Season 4. This is Proving Ground. Happy to be with us wherever you may be. I am Eddie Matt, the lead voice of the Destiny Championship Alliance, alongside everyone from the commentator. Besides this handsome gentleman, Mr. SRH and MTBDHKK. Ten matches tonight, every championship in DCA on the line. We are loaded this evening. Without a doubt we're loaded. Alright, if the pre-show is anything to go by, ladies and gentlemen, this this night is gonna be explosive. And let's be honest, the pre-show was a the pre-show was a barn burner, but let's hope the main let's hope the main let's hope the main course can live up to the appetizer. I got a feeling it will. And if it does, we're gonna be in for a night that I'm sure you fans of virtual wrestling will never forget. And we're kicking things off strong. With the DCA Pure Championship match. And there you see the challenger. Mr. Chris Douglas. And you know he's been wanting an opportunity at the Iron Man. Here at Chris Douglas will look to do what no one else has been able to do in the Destiny Championship Alliance in nearly a count in a, nearly the calendar year since he has joined. That is score pinfall victory over him. And now here, go ahead, Eddie. And the familiar sound of Black Sabbath plays in the only pure champion in the history of the Best of Championship Alliance. Indeed, and the people who Aaron Anderson had to go through to Anderson. win that championship. Baltimore crowd definitely treating Anderson with the respect he so rightfully deserves. Indeed. And this matchup is underway for the Pure Championship. Well, guys, the Pure Championship's on the line right now. It's Chris Douglas versus Aaron Anderson. Here we go. 25-minute time limit for the Pure title. 20. 20-minute uh, 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 time limit. Uh, 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 yeah, 
Uh, you have a clock in the upper right corner of the screen. Yep, that's new. Um, for pure championship matches on CPVs, all pure title matches will be contested under a 20 minute time limit. Meaning Chris Douglas will have to pin or submit Aaron Anderson before the clock hits zero if he wishes to become DC or pure champion. Now. There's a lock up, Aaron Anderson, side headlock. And takes him right down. Keeping the uh, headlock held there, and now Douglas, the head scissors hold there, and no. Anderson back with the side headlock. Oh! Oh, that knee. Massive knee strike right to the skull. And the Iron Man telling Douglas to bring it. Look at this, Nick, trying to exchange knees here, but both men blocking the other. Oh! That was not blocked hard. That was! It's a midsection, an elbow, another kick. That was responsible with the right hand of his own. Look out, look out, look out! Oh! Knee right to the dome! Pirate whip and a back elbow. Now the cover. Only a one, one count. count. You gotta wonder what uh, what Douglas needs to bring to the table in order to get a victory over somebody who not only is the champion but is also undefeated in competition. Indeed. And oh God. Anderson and Douglas are from are familiar polls. Those two along with. Uh, I believe it was Kerry Robinson. <laughs> We're in a triple threat match for the pure title back in our Revelation. Revelation's great. Dean, look out! Oh! I rush away through. That was that was the last we saw of Aaron Anderson. I believe until no, that was back in Gateway. Oh! And a slam there, Douglas, with the cover, but only a one count. Ducking under the clothesline, and Douglas, oh! <laughs> Making Anderson eat some canvas there. Indeed, and ladies and gentlemen, we're three minutes into this match. 17 minutes left to go on that clock, and Chris Douglas still does not seem any closer to defeating the Iron Man here. That chopper. Right Right across the chest, a kick. And a oh, close and a line. Close line. The Iron Man. Neck breaker. And now Anderson. Oh, oh. huge back oh. suplex right there. And the Iron Man with the cover. Anderson, One. and no. no. I should have been in the corner. Oh, and here comes Chris Douglas. Look at this. Oh, oh. God. Ow. Ow. That hurt. Douglas resorting to underhanded tactics. Though against the Iron Man, you got to do what you got to do. And oh, my God, look at these head blasts. And now the cover! One! And no! No. no. Oh, missed Ooh, the max snap there. Indeed. And oh! Huge clothesline. And now, here comes Anderson. Oh! And Doug's continuing the assault. Web now and Douglas bring Anderson into the the buckling. Thank oh! <clears throat> and look what? out! Here comes Douglas. Camel clutch. The camel clutch applied. 
He's not sitting down on it fully, though. Not quite sure. Anderson, yep, taking full advantage and getting out of that. Bilger should have sat right back down on, on that camel clutch. But Douglas keeping up the pressure and oh, arm drag reversal right, right there. The Iron Man, impressive. And look out, big suplex, fisherman suplex with the cover, shoulders down. And no. A near perfect succession there. Unfortunately, only a two count and a trip from Douglas. Look at this. Going deep with the clutch here. And Anderson is in the middle of the ring. Oh, God. Anderson now in trouble. This could be it. Wait, Anderson. Oh. <laughs> oh! Yanking on the head right there. And now, oh, here comes Anderson. Oh! Guys. We, we, we got a bleeder. We got a bleeder. The Iron Man. Opened up, but he's still fighting. And oh, good God Almighty! And oh, Chris Douglas going for the cover. One, one, two, two, and no. And Douglas off the ropes. No, looking for the knees. Anderson now. Big suplex. Oh, brain oh, buster. Oh, brain buster. One, two, and no. Oh. Jesus. And oh, no. Look out, here he comes! The Iron Man! Throwing some bones at, at Douglas here, and Douglas fighting back. Oh God, just breaking his face across the ropes now. Oh, and a shoulder tackle there. But Douglas, quick to get out. Oh! Oh! Ow. Oh! No that, way, no. That kind of looked like it sucked. Uh, yeah, I, I, I think it... Did, it, did his legs hit the steps there? Or? Some hit the steps, I heard him. Oof. A backbreaker. Now no, a harsh whip. Look out, here comes Douglas. Gentlemen, you see we're inching closer to the halfway mark. I'm all pure title matches now. And Mega events contested on the 20 minute time limit. I'm pretty sure that time limit will carry over to other DCA events, but we'll have to see. Can I go Camel Clutch? And Anderson frees himself. Whoa! Oh! Ooh. Hitting hard on the floor. 
And here he comes! Oh! 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 Jason Collins five cents for that DDT. That is bad times for the Iron Man. Tornado DDT on the floor. And the cover. One, two, and no. Oh. Aaron Anderson still alive. You know, Aaron Anderson has to feel like the luckiest guy in the world because all he has to do is pretty much what stand twenty minutes, and he yeah, can still keep the title. Is this true? Indeed. A lot can happen in 20 minutes, including blood loss, as you can clearly see. Aaron Anderson is losing blood by the second, and if if there was a time for flurry for a flurry, that it, that would be it. Anderson! Oh! oh! There's a start of one, and you know that just surviving is not Anderson's style. He wants to win. Absolutely. That's I I I'm not saying oh. oh. Fine, Buster. Aaron Anderson with a diamond cutter on himself. It was not very effective. That was off the spine buster. That's only a two. And I'm, I'm not saying Aaron Anderson, Aaron Anderson needs to survive to be happy. I'm, I'm saying, I'm saying like he might be put in a position where he has no choice. Oh! oh! The Jason J Memorial Sling Blade. One. Two. And no! And for a man who says he wants to be DCA world champion, I'm sure I'm pretty sure he does not want to be, quote, satisfied with a tie. Well, especially because not only not only would he not have gotten a definitive win or watch. Oh! Oh, oh! oh god! The referee got taken out! Nicholas Rowley is down and it is bad! So what happens when we don't have A.J. Monahan, I'm just saying. He wouldn't Look put out. up with that. Look out, Anderson! He's playing in the crowd and oh, what a shoulder block! Jawbreaker reversal. Massive running headbutt right there right from Chris Douglas. The two these guys. Oh, no, he didn't get it. He didn't knock out. Oh, ho, ho. to the outside. And... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Elizabeth Killer. What? Two. And no. Oh. Back suplex right there. We're going to see the originator of the Elizabeth Killer here tonight for the first time on a, at a mega event this season. Really? Yeah. Well, she's talking about my me, Shibashi, on after the rave starts. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh! oh. I'm taking our team movie. Tornado DDT and Aaron Anderson is, he is hurt. Here's a question. Can a D oh god, Douglas trying to split open, split it open, Anderson even more. And I gotta ask. Oh my can god. A title, can a title be? Can a title change, change hands via knockout? Um, I'm sure it can. It hasn't happened in DC. It hasn't happened in DC in a while. I guess that's. I guess the. I guess the. I guess it's up to the referee. Oh! To the side there. What were you saying? Anderson! Oh! oh! Boss man slam. Who's the boss now? I'll give you a hint. And his name's the Iron Man. Under five minutes to go in this pure championship match. Oh my goodness. The guy, oh, oh! That was an insane counter into a bulldog. 
Picture they got right there. Okay. Chop. Another chop. Stuck this guy in mind here. Less than four minutes now as he sends Anderson to the outside. Now Douglas. He's, he's feeling funky. Douglas, look out! Oh! And good God. Can you just see the, the blood pouring down the lifeless face, the lifeless expression of a face that is Aaron Anderson? He is a bloody mess right now. And Chris Douglas may be seconds away from ending this one, guys. No! Oh! Or not. And oh, Anderson! Oh he might do this. He might do it. Oh! Slam! One, One, the cover! Two! No! <laughs> two and a half minutes left. And Anderson! Close line! Has the window closed? On Aaron he Anderson, oh my goodness! Wait, wait, wait a minute! Chris Douglas! Chris Douglas! Oh god. Oh! Oh! Oh god, He's pile gone. driver! Dead. One! They killed him! Two! No! Oh. Anderson's still alive! Oh god! Oh no, now what? And again! Anderson gets sent out and. Oh no. Oh no. Oh! Wrecking ball dropkick through the corner post and. Douglas is going to try to. I'm going to try to capitalize hey, here. This is Douglas' match to lose, but he's got to mind the clock. It's under 100 seconds now. Down to under a minute and a half. He has a minute and a half to do oh, what God. no one in God, DC has done before. Deadlift. Oh, God. Damn. Downward suplex. And three. A triple gut wrench off the deadlift. One minute remains. Oh. Look out. Oh, oh DC. DC. We got another bleeder. We got a bleeder. Look out. Oh, oh. oh my goodness. It's desperation time. Only 30 seconds left, and oh, what a scoop slam. Douglas has to finish it now. Uh oh oh! Right, Anderson has to finish this now if he wants to keep a clean record. Wait, wait, Anderson! Anderson! Anderson. Oh! He needs to go for the pin! He needs to go for the pin! Shoulders down! Five One, seconds! Two! Three! Oh, With two seconds to spare! Woo! <laughs> Anderson retains at the wire. God, God <laughs> Almighty! I mean, this was a close call for both these men. It wasn't just a it wasn't just a close call. It was a battle. A battle that Chris Douglas surprisingly a fight to. As Aaron Anderson beaten, battered, and bloodied with two seconds remaining on the clock, managed to get the win. Douglas had plenty of opportunities to put this thing away, but Aaron Anderson just would not. <laughs> Stay down.
that was right, right, right into that top turnbuckle. And Anderson delivers the iron slam. And Robert the one, two, three. Two seconds to spare, guys. He was two seconds away from having a tie in his record. Instead, Aaron Anderson remains undefeated and unblemished. The pure champion standing tall once again. This guy is definitely, definitely deserving to be in that world title picture conversation. If it wasn't apparent before. Cleopatra Spinks to challenge Sakura Hagiwara and Selena Zayn later tonight for the DCA Wildcats Championship. What an opening contest we just had, guys. Exactly. That was that, that was the first match of the night. We have already went through a tremendous free show. The momentum the momentum of these matches are still going and very strong. I, wow. <laughs> I, I'll be honest with you, I, 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 Aaron Anderson, he looked like he was in trouble. It oh, absolutely. Like it, 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 I mean, it didn't look like he was going to have a tie. It, it looked like he was going to end up being the next champion, but the Iron Man just met, managed to hang on. And he was just two seconds. I, I'll, I'm going to hammer that down a little bit. Two seconds from the time, yeah. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're moments away from the Wildcats Tag Team Championship match as the Rave Slayers take on Team Ruby. Former ACL Lioness Tag Team Champions, I, I mean, they know what it takes to go for gold, and I'm pretty sure... 
Oh! <laughs> Not for that shit. It's time to repent, motherfuckers! Do you hear the crowd? How came at him? Holy! <laughs> to coin a term from MTB, holy high hell! Mami Mishi Bashi! Aubrey Williams! The Rank Slayer! Uh, Eddie, is it is it me or there's or are they sporting new custom tag titles? I, I do believe it is not you. Huh? Well, I'll, I'll, I'll be among his uncle. Let's hope it's not a one time thing for him. My dog. Team Ruby might have something to say about it. Especially if we're going by recent trends. Since last summer, I mean, they practically have, own the tag division. I mean, they've owned the tag division to the point where DCS literally had to go outside the box to find challenges for them. So now they felt they, that now they they have the belts. They should really plant the name on them. I, I guess so, but um. Right now, it's uh, Blake and uh, Aubrey taking each other on in the Northern Lights. And, oh! He's <laughs> a dry kick from Williams. And, get the leg out of the leg. Leg out of the leg. So Eddie, Eddie, you you've you've been you've been around the block for oh, gross effects. You've been around the block quite a bit in your time on on the table. Yeah. What would you? What advice would you give Team Ruby going into this match? If you had that chance. Um. I'll, I well, for one, don't don't end up in situations like that. You know, as a start. Well, that's a good. Yeah, they're gonna have Team Ruby's gonna have to isolate one or the other. Oh, because you know, one against one of the Rage Slayers, they'll, they'll probably be just fine. But after all, each member of Team Ruby has beaten one of the Rage Slayers in the last two weeks. It's one thing to beat them one on one, Eddie. But it's another thing to beat him as a pair. Oh. Stung gone off the fireman's carry in my Mimi. And here comes. Yang Zhao Wong. Yang Zhao Wong. That clothesline taken down my Mimi. Yang the powerhouse of the duo. Indeed, an adept striker as well. Oh. And Yang being dropped after a back suplex. And my Mimi! Oh! Who's the mix? Back break, oh my cousin. I know, my I know, Mimi. I know your 
I know there's, I know there's a cliche that, you know, whenever someone gets momentum, they're hard to stop. Yeah, that's true. That definitely applies to the Rage Slayers. More specifically, my Mimi. I mean, she's a freaking ball of momentum every time she steps into the ring. Indeed. And now, oh! Tripping her up right here. Look out! Oh! oh what an elbow! Oh, 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 oh no, no, God! No. Oh. Good night! Ow. So much ow! Ow! So much ow! Well, it was nice knowing you, Yang. Oh, wait. Yay with the dragon with the drag to reversal. Oh! Get the way in the face! Right in the face. Oh! oh. <laughs> and a head butt that was definitely lethal and definitely not sweet. Dropping the was that a fist drop? I believe that was a fist drop, yes. Oh, okay. Try to make sure I, uh, I'm seeing things. Look at this! Dad lifts it out, bomb there from, from Long here, and the, now she tags in her partner Blake. And listen to the crowd getting behind, uh, Team Ruby here. And now, oh. Look out! Big suplex! And a quick cover here. One. No. Yeah, they need a lot more than that to put away a Proto J from Lee Brown. Indeed. And. Ang Zhao Long getting tagged back in. There's a wrestling championship also on the line here at Proving Ground for us. Roman Cortez and Maddie finally face off for the first time ever. Oh! Both ladies have declined interviews throughout the day leading up to this event. You mean for the first time in a DCA exclusive mega event? No, first time anywhere. Didn't they face at Queens of Wrestling 3? Oh, this is true. First time since the first time since the fight. Eh. No oh, sit out spine buster. Well, I can't really what? blame Eddie Mac on that Dude. one, SRH. <clears throat> After no, all, there's a lot to be excited for with the rematch between Carmen and Naughty. Um, Eddie and I brought it up when we were doing predictions. I mean, oh. They, they took each other to the limit when they liked each other. Oh! But considering that, considering that, considering the change between them in the, in the three plus months, yeah. <laughs> Can't wait to see that. And my Mimi. Uh oh. Oh! Good Lord. Snake eyes onto the apron there. Well, that sucked. I mean, it sucks for it sucks for long, but probably not for my mini. Oh no, because it's a it's a step closer to potentially win a banger ring a bam. Bang! Oh, my mini. Uh, ring with the cover Two and, and no. And a drive kick to the back of the noggin. You gotta think, the race players were embarrassed the past couple weeks right. when they were humbled in singles competition. Right. They want to show why they are the tag team champions, and they're not gonna let oh, they're not gonna let a team from another company oh, take oh, over what they work hard for. And oh, oh drive oh. by. And now the cover. One, two, Ooh, and Blake. Blake. And you see Aubrey trying to go to work on Blake and wait, long reverse ET. And Nicholas Riley has well, for, for a brief moment has lost control of this match. Get it together, Nick. 
That's again, this one. Oh, sit up, on. Oh. And again, this wouldn't happen if AJ Monahan was yep. in the ring. Just he, he he don't take no craps. Look at this! Oh, schoolboy bomb there! The good news is, DC actually did spring from my hands. Thank God! No. And Yang using that bionic arm to her advantage, too? No! And now the tag, Blake, back in the. Uh, Back in the ring. Oh, I ain't kidding. That that that's that can have a. Oh no! It, no, it can't. It, oh, driver, get there and crucifix driver there. Oh, and a hot tag. Here comes, Here comes Aubrey. Oh. Oh. I, I, I can easily say, as of right now, the claws are out and the cats are scratching. Are we up on the second level? She's got a mind here. Little rope Hurricane Rana there. And Aubrey just taking her time to taunt him. I'm not even sure if that's a great idea. I think she should stay on. Oh! I Right now, because considering that it's just her kind of active on her side right now, because my Mimi's out right now. Oh! Gee! You know who else is out right now? Like, well done. Maybe. Next Very step well there. Could be. Going to work on the legs there. Oh! <laughs> Not every Irish whip. I think it's time. Oh, Repent, motherfucker! <laughs> One, two. Got a breakup. <coughs> Long right there to break the count. One more look at. Motherfucker! And along with the stomp, and then we see this crucifix driver from Williams. <coughs> and now, armbar number 378. There's an old drop to hold there. Oh! Hot tag! tag. Close on! Jang! Another close on! Another close on! Those bionic close lines from. from Wong and she's hammering away! <coughs> Dad, what? Set up, oh. set up, 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 set Oh, yeah. dang, all right, all right, all right. Bam. Now going for the cover. Find me. Two. And no. Oh, Yang had to kick out. Said, don't, because Blake was not going to be in a position to break it up. Oh. Kicking her, kicking her leg out of her leg. Yeah, that's, that's the terminology, right? Yes. <laughs> 
Kicking her legs out from under her. Out of her leg. Ed. Yang. Ow! Yang. Bulldog. That's the Oh. Wait a minute. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. The local Baltimore newspaper is reporting, oh, two drive-bys at the stadium. <laughs> One, two, no. Oh. <laughs> that joke felt like a drive-by. Bobby Williams, what you got in mind here? Oh, the ropes out! Missed the drop! Nobody holding the elbow! Oh! Look at this! Oh, there is a strike in Wong now! And uh oh! Uh -oh. oh Look God. out! That'll go out. Oh! 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 oh. He's dead. He's dead. They killed her. What? My Mimi leaping out of her corner just to save the match. And I kick. Another kick. Another kick. More kicks. Oh! One, two, no! Oh, oh, oh. Potentially, oh god, that draw kick. Potentially on any other nine with any other team, that probably would have been it on Team Rook 10. But these are the match slayers, one of the best duels in virtual wrestling. Oh, wait a minute! Oh my god! Try for a label lock, but no such luck. Look out, Aubrey Williams, he's got her up, and no! Reversal! Oh. It may be down to these two guys. Close line. Another close line. Williams! Another close line. A throw up. Duck. Close line. Clothesline after clothesline, and Aubrey Williams is bringing the fight. And oh! Oh! oh. Pump kick boot. from Aubrey, and another arm bar. And now the bows are being thrown. Wait, reversal on the whip there and okay. look out, look out, look out! Ow! DDT. Ow! <laughs> God almighty in heaven. This has been a magic guys, hasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it has. No. Oh, look out, look out, look out! Hey. Oh! oh. Stun gun. Crucifix, but no pin there. And I'm Mimi. I, 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 I wonder if she's just trying to... Oh! Sit out, Buster, and... One! Two! No! As I was saying, I, I'm, I'm wondering if my meme is just getting frustrated with the fact that Team Ruby won't stay down. I think the frustration has to set in at some point, right? Look out, look out! Oh! No water in the pool and. Back, 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 back,
And my Mimi! Bang a ring a ring a bam! Bang a ring around the world! My Mimi's not done here! Oh! oh. I hope, I hope Blake cover. does a good chiropractor! <laughs> this is your hometown, Eddie. Do you know where any good chiropractors are? <laughs> Oh, not for me, for Team Ruby. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll try. I'll try. Oh, God, my Mimi! Oh! 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 And, oh, no. Not again. Yes, again. Oh! oh! oh God. Sahaya, come back! She needs the power of love! You don't love her? Oh! Yang, look at the finish in here! Oh. Right hand! Right hand! Three right hands and there she goes! It, my Mimi, I wouldn't be taunting in, in the devil's corner there if I were you. And there's why. Oh! And guys, can you believe this? Neither team wants to stay down here. Oh, I can believe it. They've, they've been showing this throughout the entirety of the match. And oh, oh, my God! Oh. <laughs> that was like Mimi weird. landed that on look. the back of her head. That should be. I mean, did you see the way she kind of folded there? And the yeah, uh, yeah. And no, uh, oh no. Right, maybe look at put the finishing touches on this one. Crossbody. One, two, no. no. Oh. Look at this. Oh, it's a chair drop from Long to Williams. What's it gonna take? Something tells me not much more, guys. All, all, all each team needs is a good move in three seconds, and it could be over. And Blake, no. My Mimi firing back and across body. One, two, no. Yeah, the frustration is definitely setting in on on my Mimi. I'm still down on the outside. My Mimi's gonna have to finish this thing on her own. Maybe in the arm drag off the top rope. Oh God. She may just very well have to, and look out! Bulldog! No, uh -oh, looking for the quick tag to oh, Aubrey in here, it is! Oh, oh! And look out! Oh! 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 Yeah, <laughs> oh! Lord! Gek! 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 Ah, the oh. Gek! Guys, I think it might be Team Ruby's night to win it. This might be their match to lose now. Oh, wait a minute! That's the Irish whip. And I, oh! Oh, I... Aubrey was trying to play it smart, but uh. look out! Oh, oh come on. this has been an absolute barn burner, guys. 
That is shadow of a doubt. What is what is got in mind here? Oh! oh and Aubrey, looking for the cover. One, one, two, two. Got him. Jesus, H Christ. Wow. The common it. theme for the past few matches were close calls. As much energy as these two teams expended, any move could have finished that match. I'd like to think that any move probably would have finished the match if there were any other circumstances against any other teams except for the, well, the two teams in this. It could have been any move to finish it off, but no. These teams wanted to keep going until this forearm. Now, ironically, Team Ruby are the first who didn't repent, but still lost. Well, there's no shame in losing to the Raves, though. I mean, everybody loses to the Raves, though. They're, they're, I, mean, I, will, I will say this, they are tough to sell, and I would love to see them go at it again. They took, they took Rave Slayer's best move, and were still able to stay in the match. I, mean, I, I don't think any team can say they did. Indeed, that was definitely one hell of a match. And who knows what team it'll take to end the streak. I, the I, only question is, honestly, Eddie, when and who? I mean, how, how far out of the box do we have to, how far out of the box do DC have to go to find someone to, that can beat the Rave Slayers? I mean, I'm sure that, that I know there are new teams in in this company that are, that have formed in recent months to, um, that may that may have a that may have a say in the matter, but Rave Slayers are just on a roll right now. Indeed, but guys, we gotta shift gears because coming up next is the Rising Star Championship match. Uh, I believe it. I believe it, it is. The, yeah, no, it's the Fever Championship match. It's the Fever Championship match. It no, match. oh, it is. It is the Rising Star Championship match, Eddie. To be contested under traditional, thanks to Balalaika, traditional Fatal Four Way rules. Fatal Four Way elimination, actually. Yep, this will be an elimination. This will be for the first time. The Rising Star title will be contested in an elimination match. And it's time for a little bit of ninja wrestling as Jade as Jade Storm makes her way down to the ring. Well, Jade Storm set for action tonight. And SRH, this is certainly going to be in a, a huge opportunity for Jade Storm. Yeah, well, here's the thing. She has to face three other women. She don't even know who the fourth, who, who, who the mystery woman is. Well, we definitely know who this person is. The woman who originally qualified for this match. Until Ball like it added Jade Storm and a mystery signee. And Trish, the rogue, making her way down to the ring, SRH. I 
I, uh... <laughs> a former Rising Star Champion in her own right. I talked with Eddie earlier tonight about who my pick to win this match and as much as I as much as I respect the prowess and and the lineage that each of these ladies have, we don't know the mystery opponent and that's that's gonna be the wild card. That might be what trumps each of those three ladies. Oh well, we're about to find out who the mystery opponent is and What? SRH! What? Hold the phone! Holy mother of freaking God Almighty, I hell! Okay, did you know about this? I did not! Me neither! Oh, oh I could just did something I liked! Jennifer uh, me Cruel has been signed to DCA! I, I mean... Can, can you really say that? I mean... She, she made that promise! At the season opener, she was gonna bring... New talent. She was going to bring underrated talent. She was going to try to give them a resurgence that they deserved. Well, nonetheless, here comes the champion, Lacey Adams. Turned at Revelations, winning the Rising Star Championship. So, I guess you can say hey, you're probably glad that I predict that I'm making the prediction that our girl Jennifer Cruel is going to win this, right? Well, there's some pretty tough competition. Exactly, but Jennifer Crow probably has the biggest advantage of those of the rest of the three. Indeed. And the Rising Star Championship is on the line right now. Lacey Adams defending against Trish Jade Storm and the de debuting Jennifer Cruel. Good God. And here we go! Oh, Jade Storm! Starting things off with Jennifer Cruel with a Hurricane Ron and Lacey Adams taking the fight to Trish. You know, it is a definite shame that uh, Zahaya isn't here because there's a lot of leather in this match just for him. And here we see. Wait, wait, oh! DDT there. Massive DDT. For those of you... Oh, and not a you, massive DDT. Real quick point here, ladies and gentlemen. For those of you who don't know who Jennifer Krul is, I recommend checking out my personal league, TPGW, The People's Global uh, Wrestling. Ow, she, ow, no, ow. For there, Jennifer Krul is a former women's world champion and the current holder of the women's Money in the Bank contract. Could you imagine Jennifer winning the Rising Star title and then going on to TPGW, cashing in her money in the bank, and being the women's champion in TPGW? Being, oh! It's, it's very possible, SRH. Across two different leagues. No! And oh, God. Look out, look out, look out! 
Oh, oh! Done gun there. Trish. Indeed, hanging Trish up on the ropes. Right now, Jade, Jade Storm. It. Indeed, Jade Storm is taking the fight to Jennifer Cruel. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, that this is under elimination rules. You would, you would think that these ladies would try to gang up on the champ here to get her out early. That's oh, not always God. necessarily the smart decision. Did you just see what? Oh, oh! God, Red! That, that's what it's called, right? Indeed. And look at Jennifer! Oh! <laughs> Trish trying to dang in this as much as she can. Just now. Oh! Arm drag off the top. And Jade Storm back up with a higher switch. Trish has to be the most frustrated out of all the women's in this match, SRH. She was expecting a one-on-one. -on -one. Same same with Lacey. Oh, God. Well, I certainly am happy to see Jennifer Cruel in action. You gotta think it's a little bit unfair of Balaika to make this a fatal four-way. I, I mean... You have to, you have to admit, all all title matches are set to be multi-person matches. So she was in the rules, and those were set by Lucinda herself. I, I mean, that that was Lucinda's order before she got taken out, and. If it was one on one, we wouldn't see Jennifer in a DCA ring potential. Well, that's very true. Speaking of which, Jennifer Cruel just taking down Trish there. And an elbow dropped to the small of the back while Jade Storm is going to work on the champ. Look, oh my. Uh, well. There's, oh! there's no disqualifications. That was as legal as a headlock. God. And on top of it, go back to my point just a bit ago. You gotta give Ball Like a credit for signing somebody with the caliber, with the talent such as Jennifer Cruel. I don't disagree with the signing. I just agree with the changing of the match. Well, I mean, it's not like they didn't know in advance. Oh! Oh! Codebreaker! Oh! One! Two! And no. no! As of now, Lacey Adams is still the champ. And whoa, look out! Look out, look out! Trish! The cruiserweight series there. And she throws Jennifer Cruel out. Look at Jade Storm, half Boston Crab. Shades of Lance Storm. And oh, as is his driver there from Trish, taking out Jennifer Cruel here and continuing the assault. And Jay Storm with that snap suplex to Lacey. And Lacey, drag and screw to Jade Storm. Irish went back into the ring. Oh, oh, oh my god! Super kick! With the cover, one, one two, two. And Lacey Adams is eliminated. We're going to get a new champion. Oh, 
Trish with the cover on Jennifer for on the belly of belly. And Jennifer is eliminated. And now it's down to one on Warren. Just like just like Trish wanted. And oh it's the two women who fought the revelations in a no holds barred match. Where Jade won. So you gotta think Trish is looking for a little bit of redemption here. And Trish almost won there following that move. And I'll throw up Zell! And, oh god. Jawbreaker there from Jade Storm and Jade. Deep Exploder. Oh, oh god. Ow. 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 And now the cover. One, two, no. And Trish is in trouble. Jay Storm off the ropes. Oh, what an elbow drop. You know, you can kind of see that Jade's taking the... Oh! oh! Jesus! I was going to say, her move palette has a... Uh, had a sh bit of shades of uh, Amber Stevens, you know her, her she, the woman who she calls her hero. Oh, detonation kick! Massive detonation kick right there. Super kick! And now the cover. One, two, and. Jade Storm, once again, humbling Trish. Jade Storm is finally a champion in DCA. Oh. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> After winning her first match at Revelation, she wins again here to become the Rising Star Champion. What a match. Oh. Congratulations to Jade Sto Storm for winning the Rising Star Championship. And what a match. Her ninja army behind her, cheering her on and celebrating. Oh, wait a minute! Wait a minute! Who's the? Oh! What the? Oh my God! I know who that is. Who is that? Oh, that's that's uh. That's that's Melissa Remy. Who? She she is. Oh God. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Oh! Patience. Who is this woman? And what is her problem with Jay Storm? Well. Here, here's the thing. Remember how we brought uh, we, we brought up Amber Stevens earlier? She's a student of Amber Stevens. What? Yeah. I'm 
think Amber, I don't think Amber would be proud of what what she just did to Jay Storm there. I I don't know. I I remember Amber bringing me a uh, contract for Melissa Remy because she was about to be signed on to the WFS and. She mentioned something about Melissa having a bit of a hot temper. But I never expected her to show up. Well, she showed up all right. Yeah, she's... She, she made an immediate impact on the new Rising Star champion here. No, no kidding. I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm flabbergasted right now. You and me both. Well, guys, coming up next. Oh, it's going down in a cage, ladies and gentlemen. Smokey, AJ Young, the long-standing rivalry will finally be settled. In the confines of a steel cage. And here comes the longest reigning Call All Stars champion in history. to thank AJ Young. And to think, guys, AJ Young was supposed to be in the world title tonight. tonight. All like a all well, like I said that this needed to end tonight. Uh, I agree. I mean, she she did the right thing considering considering the uh, considering the. Uh, Absolutely. I mean, we saw what happened at survival. What just just uh shade under two months ago? And here he comes. The man known as the last outlaw of virtual wrestling. And the former DCA World Heavyweight Champion. Twice. Moki. DCA Superstar of the Year in, 20, in, 20, in 2017. Let's be honest, in Smokey's mind, if it wasn't for AJ Young, he would probably still be world champion right now, or he could be a three time world champion right now. And here we go! AJ Young. Smokey, deal okay. And remember, guys, Smokey is undefeated inside a cage and or cell environment. He's been in 13 of them in his career and he's won them all. And to think if it wasn't for AJ Young, this match 
Bro, yeah. But AJ doesn't want Smokey as a world champion. No! Oh. What? Why could it reverse all things considered? And something tells me vice versa. Now Smokey just digging in the floor. <laughs> And Smoky guys, you gotta these think. Friends here. Oh, no trip. In the history of AJ Young, the history of his entire career, not just here in DCA, but everywhere else, you gotta think. The question has to be asked: Would AJ Young be the man he is if Smokey had, if Smokey had returned to call All Stars after the first one? I, I don't, I, to answer your question, I don't know. There is something. AJ still has a title shot that he earned at Revelations. Oh! Oh, oh Laika ordered it. Well, these are two old school guys in virtual wrestling. Oh, someone will clash in a judo hip toss there. Oh! Big reversal right there. Oh! <laughs> Ow! Look out, look out, oh! oh goodness. Head first off the cage. Neck breaker! Neck breaker. Now the cover, no! Pinfall is a mission to win this thing. In. Yeah. And Smokey. Oh, oh! Elbow drop. Now with the cover. One, two, and, and no. By the way, when we say first man now, we mean first man out of the cage with both feet on the floor on the other side of the cage. I mean, not, not that we, not that we, not that we. I mean, these people are watching all that, right? Indeed. Oh, oh. Oh! oh. Into the small of the back end. Smokey. No! Right back into it. Oh! Down by Young. Uh, Smokey, oh! oh. God! A.G. Young, the ever... Oh, adaptable to his environment. And now, now the cover one. Cover. Ew. AJ Young in shock. And AJ Young, regardless of whether he wins or loses, will face either Takiru or Calvin Richardson for the world championship. Of the ropes, oh, what a crossbody from Smokey. The last outlaw. Uh, to think if Smokey beats, if Smokey beats AJ Young here tonight, he's probably back in the world title picture, isn't he? Uh, I mean, yeah, hey, are you saying contender. that Smokey doesn't belong in the world title picture oh, anyway? Oh, absolutely. I'm absolutely not saying oh! that. Oh! <laughs> oh, no, no. Wow, that, 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 oh. that kind of sucked. Oh, oh, oh. But to answer your question, MTV, I'm not saying Smokey doesn't belong in the world title picture. But it's going to be hard to make a case if he doesn't. But if you, it's going to be hard to make a case for him to be in the world title picture if he doesn't be AJ Young here tonight. But if Smokey does win, we could have the potential for a four, four man world title match situation.
Oh, look at this! No! Oh! oh. He hit him so hard, he caught him open, which means we got a bleeder. Got a bleeder. And AJ continuing the onslaught. He's dragging Smokey over to the cage and he slams him into the buff. Oh, that's what? I'll tell you what, that bandana is it. That man that is only gonna smoke suck up so much blood. It's starting to write down his face now. No! Oh! Jesus! No! Oh! oh hey, and look smoke who's here! He's had enough. It, you're late. That's you're late. Look! Look! You're late. You're late. You're late. You're late. You're late. Yeah. Hi, do you want to know what you missed? I feel like you're going to let me on it anyway, so go ahead. You missed the DCA debut of Jennifer Cruel. Oh, gentlemen. We have another bleeder. Jesus. Wait, are you, are you serious? Yes. Yeah. Oh yeah, and uh, yeah, you you miss you miss quite a bit of leather. Oh, and you miss Jade Storm winning. You miss three matches. You miss the Rave Slayers retaining. You miss Jade Storm winning the Rising Star Championship. Wait, what? Yeah. Oh, how about that? Congrats, Jade. Before getting attacked by Dave, who was she? Alessa Remy. Oh, no! Back, back, stun eye. And you missed Aaron Anderson retaining, and now Anderson. Smokey going for the Anderson. cover. Anderson. And Zahaya, by the way, you missed my Mimi. She believed in you, and you missed it. God Jade. damn it. Jade. 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 Jade believed in you, too. Jade. Jade, what are you? Hey, you missed a career moment, man. Guess what? Oh. Two laps for that. Yeah. God, what? Two? two laps. Let's go. Speaking ah. of two, smoke, smoke is picking out a two from getting right in the head. Nice save. No! Oh, Jesus. God, God he saw Smokey staggering after that. Oh. And a Queen's Gambit from AJ Young. And there's the kick out. This has been, this has been every bit as cool as, as we thought it would be. And AJ, oh! Right for the second rope swanton, no luck. And it's Smokey. Oh, okay. Spiked him on his head there. Cover. One. Two. No! Oh. AJ Young barely gets a shoulder up. Look out! Oh! He said this match was not going to be pretty. It's not going to be for the fan of heart. And it is proving to be so. Oh my goodness. He stomped on his head again. Right on that open wound. Look out. Oh! You jump or cut from AJ Young. And AJ. Looking smoky up. This is not going to be good, guys. This is not going to be good. AJ Young, pass Smokey. For the most of you, he's moved. No! That's like super flex. And look at, look at AJ. AJ's going to try and climb out here. 
He's gonna try to scale the wall there. This is the first attempt by either man to win this match. He escaped in. AJ no, he's AJ rushing AJ. over there. He's got it. We can climb down by Smokey. Smokey! German! God. Oh god, oh, oh, stop oh! Stop in a muddle! Uh, I, I said stop in a muddle! What? what? I, I said stop in a muddle and AJ Young! Alright. We stopped in a muddle and so forth and so on. What? And, and such he, things. He done, he done stopped the muddle. <laughs> 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 so did you get anything for us? What? what? Did you get any? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! AJ Young! That's Smokey! Oh! oh. 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 Jesus! You know what's the higher? Since you didn't get us anything, take another lap. These Jeez. men. How much? Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> <laughs> How much more? Oh! No. God in heaven! Uh, oh, Smokey! Oh! Jesus. Cover. Why? Two. No. 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 AJ Young is finding out the hard way why Smokey's never lost a cage match. Yeah, and, Sm and Smokey's learning out the hard way of why AJ Young is probably the top star here on the takedown division. Look out, look out, oh! Oh, here we go! Here we go! AJ! No more! Whoa, 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 what? Whoa. He's getting up! Oh, He's getting up! Woo! Fuck your character. Oh, Alabama oh. water slide, baby! Here at Proving Ground, starring the last outlaw. Al Smokey climbing. They're trying to escape the cage here. You were saying, MTV? Oh, wait. Well, you were saying it's high. <laughs> AJ right back up. And oh! Yeah. You are saying, Mr. SRH. And now AJ Young gonna look to put this one away. No! You were saying it's high. This match! It's not even a main event. As Brian Henniger would say, this could be a main event anywhere else in the country. No, Now that these men know where they are. Oh my goodness. Oh god, oh god, oh god! No! Missed! Oh! No see dough around and around. Where do we where do we stop? No one knows. Probably on 95 cents. In all seriousness, these first four pounds have been bar burners. Go, 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 go. Oh! <laughs> Starting with that pre show match. And it's this whole it's... night has been bar burners, though. Oh! oh. oh. Smokey misses miss with a knee. Look out! Oh! oh. 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 X Plex! An X Plex from AJ Young! How the oh, hell God. is Smokey still on? Smokey! Smokey! Oh! Smokey! Oh, how is he doing this? AJ! He's on top of the game! Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! 
Oh god, no! Oh, oh, oh. Jesus! Again! Smokey yanks him down again! And I think it's time to break some AJ. glass! AJ, no! AJ, yes! Oh, Smokey! Smokey! Oh! Jesus, mother of God! Smokey! Oh! Clothesline! These two are gonna royally destroy each other by the time this one's done. Oh, there's nothing regal about this. Oh, EJ! Oh! That's gotta do it. No! Oh my god! Wait! What the hell? Still getting up! How the hell is this happening? Finish him! Finish him! He's AJ's not gonna make sure that Smokey stays down. He's, He's gonna, gonna make, make sure. Never gets up again. No! Oh my god! No! Fuck! Oh my god. Oh! A rolling fire! Oh. Is that rolling death value, Johnny? I believe it is. That was impressive. Oh, Smokey! No! Oh! Use, use more no. Smokey counters. AJ counters. Some's got to give. Something has to give in this contest. I just don't know what. AJ said about three or four smokies right now, but unfortunately went for the wrong one. Here we go again! No! Oh! Damn, 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 damn. Like the third one of this. Oh, what the oh my god! What the fuck? How? Oh! Young disaster! That's it! Ball game! End of story! Climb the cave with the the what the 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 what? How? He's still moving. Smoke is like the Terminator. Smoke is like the Terminator right now. Oh no! Oh my God! He damn near put a thing right there. Wait, I think I think the thing opened. Oh no! 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 Smokey just. <laughs> you have to be fucking kidding me. Wow. Uh, what? <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> I don't love that. <laughs> so, um, Zahaya, what were you saying? The man by the skin of his goddamn teeth was able to find the exit before AJ could. Fucking believable. <laughs> Virtual Wrestling's last outlaw is still undefeated in a cage. <laughs>